coming to this year's presentation <coughs> for Employee of the Year, even though due to COVID it's been delayed for a few months. Uh, but you know, we get everything done. We just have to deal with things, as uh, Mr. Clarence has said before. We just learn to adapt and some new things. So uh, I'm happy to be here to make the presentation for the 2020 Employee of the Year. And for those of you who don't know how this works, fellow employees nominate other employees for Employee of the Year. It goes to the Employee of the Month Committee, which is made up of 16 employees from all the different departments of the hospital. And each month they select Employee of the Month, and then once a year, they then look at those previous 12 employees of the month and select one individual for the honor of Employee of the Year. And I'd like to take this time to thank all the members of the Employee of the Month Committee for all the hard work they've done over the last few years. Uh, I'd like to share some of the comments that were made on the nomination form about this individual. They said that she has such a professional attitude with the service orientation and is always a step ahead in anticipating your needs before you even ask. She is one of our best historians and a most valuable asset. She always has a positive attitude and is willing to assist. She is very knowledgeable and dedicated to her work. There is never a moment that she does not go above and beyond. She takes great pride in her work. She's made the difference in her many years working here. She's the voice of reason that keeps our department rolling. When we run into issues, she's always there to help us out. She's patient and understanding even when multiple departments are needing help. She is the perfect example of a team player. She exhibits the highest level of loyalty and dedication in her job duties at McLaren. She is consistently demonstrating her commitment through her ongoing support of the organization and its goals. She can be called at any time by anyone and she will drop what she is doing to provide unwavering support to the hospital patients, visitors, and staff. She displays a high level of compassion in her job duties and brings a high level of professionalism and detail on any task she is assigned or volunteers for. She's the backbone of the support services department and we are thankful that she is on the team. So it's with great pleasure that I announce that Rachel Parkinson is the employee of the year. Check that you, uh, <laughs> <laughs> that you owe, and that, that is yours, okay? <laughs> <laughs> there is a 
thoughts of an environmental appreciation that goes along with that as well. Um, and yes, I think what you really wanted was that parking spot, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 But uh, and, and I think you know from from the entire team, from our board of directors, I just want to say thank you. you you're well deserving, uh, and uh, keep doing what you're doing, and we certainly appreciate it. And I know you want to say a couple of words. <laughs> uh, well, I just thank you all for um, nominating me in the first place and um, it's an honor and there's a million people here that probably deserve it as much as I do if not more and um, I, it just means a lot to me and I appreciate it so thanks to all my co-workers and everybody else I deal with in a day um, you know I'm here for to help that's what my that's why I'm here so Thank you, I appreciate it, I really do. It's serving attitude, and that's very much appreciated. <laughs>